Next, let's figure out where you can render tweak templates. We did it in the controller, but actually templates can be rendered not only from the controller. They can also be rendered in services, emails, directly from the road. But let's start with the controller. Everything is very simple if your controller extends abstract controller. Then you can use render method, hear it, and return it. The first argument of this method is corresponding template that should be rendered, hear it. And the second optional argument is array with variables if they are needed. Hear it. If your controller doesn't extend from abstract controller, you'll need to fetch environment service in your controller and then just use its render method. I'll show it. we need to do one more thing. We need to add as control PHP attribute about the class. We have to do this because our controller doesn't extend abstract controller. So we need to apply the controller.service underline arguments tag to our controller services. And if we add as controller attribute, it will be done automatically. Also, as I said earlier, we can render a template in service. It's easier to show how to do it than explain it. So, let's go.
as for the rendering of templates in emails. We will not dwell on this topic in detail. This is a topic for a separate video. And we move on. So, let's figure out how to render a template directly from a road. Your application may contain static pages that do not require any variables. For example, it could be a privacy policy and so on. So, you can render such static pages directly from the road definition in YML, XML or PHP file. And we will use for this special template controller provided by Symfony. I'll show the example with YML file. You can also pass some default parameters such as status code, options that you need to set the page cache and so on. More about this you can find in Symfony documentation. Also as for rendering a template from XML or PHP configuration files, you can explore in Symfony documentation. As you already know from my previous videos about routing, by default Symfony loads the roads defined in YML format. For XML and PHP formats you need to add support in kernel.php file. In upper right corner you find a link to a video that will help you with this task. I hope you enjoy this video and see you next time.